really cook. We should also it's stop cooking. Yeah. Well. We just make sandwiches. Morning, guys. Morning. Morning. Are you? Are you? Um, what's your mom? Well, thanks. And yourself, Sunil? I'm good. I'm, I'm good. I'm fabulous as usual. Absolutely. It's yeah. Monday. Yeah. Hey. Mm -hmm. Did I tell you what? I tell you which is my favorite day. Uh, I think it's Monday. Every day. <laughs> Every day is my favorite day. Yeah. Every day. If you're a, if you're parents, you would know my, you. If you're a parent, you'll know Master Ugwe. Master Ugwe is um the guy from Kung Fu Panda, and his quote is. Um, yesterday is history, tomorrow is a mystery, today is a gift. That's why it's called the present. Mm. Oh, I'm going to send you guys, um, based on what you just said now, I'm going to send you a little snippet later when we're done with this thing. Hello. I hope I still have it. Hi. Hello. That's our youngest, Teddy. Hey, Clara, how's it? <laughs> Good. He's so curious about what's happening. Ah, uh, he's so cute. What's his name? Thank you. Mommy, I'm going to school. Going to school. Cute, man. Cute. Uh, welcome, everybody. Welcome, Mala. Welcome, Jewel. Welcome, um, Prashnam. Um, I think Mala is in twice. I think it's Sunina. Just mute me, uh, Sunil, if you can. Desi. Desi, my friend, welcome, 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 all of you. Who wants to uh, who wants to say say something? Who wants to say something? It's a free opportunity. Uh, please mute me. <laughs> I can't uh, seem to do it. Okay, you muted. Clara, thank you. Um, welcome, guys. Welcome, everybody. Uh, let's give it one more minute for people to hop on. So today I got a very good one for you. I'm teaching you TikTok, and I'm teaching you how to post on TikTok. Uh, who's excited? Who's excited? Me, 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 me. <laughs> no, that's cool. That's cool. That's... Morning, Sunil. How are you? Good yourself. I'm good. I'm excited for today because I've been waiting for this, this session for a while. Yes, 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 yes. I definitely need help with the TikTok. Yeah, so today I'm teaching you on uh, how to use TikTok on the computer. So, um, I'm teaching you how to use TikTok on the computer today, which is cool. I mean, it's easier, it's easier because most of us are on a computer during the day. So, <clears throat> but it differ when you're on the phone, Sunil, because I work on my phone quite often. Yeah, so the phone, I haven't seen a, I didn't see the, I didn't, I don't see the way, I don't see how to, um, on the phone, I don't know how to schedule. So I don't know if it, if it's on the phone is yet, but on the computer, it allows you to schedule. Okay. Okay. All right. I think when I think uh yeah, okay. Yeah. All right. We'll see. Play around. Okay. I think let's start. I think let's start. Um use the chat facility to chat, chat to each other on the chat facility and um use the chat facility and chat, introduce yourself, who you are, make friends. Uh I think all of you should be friends by now on Facebook and on social media because that's why we are here. It's called the social breakfast because, because we are to socialize. We are socialized. Um, so Neil, if with regards before you mute us, um, with regards to that social media, maybe on on our group we can all put our social media tag handles. Um, because I don't think we we did it on on here. We just shared email addresses or something. Yeah. So maybe we can yeah, put our. Put Put all your details there. Put all your details. Put your WhatsApp. Put your uh, put your dog's ID. Everything in there. Put your. <laughs> Thank you much. Yeah. Listen, you gave me some power there when you said when you said before you mute us. Hey, I need to invent like a like a like a to save marriages. I need to invent like a like an app. How to mute? How to mute each other? <laughs> like a remote. Remote. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome, Asha. Morning, Sunil. How's it? Where's Mo? So let's start. Um, you guys can chat on the. You can you guys can chat. You guys can chat. I'm um, so today. I'm teaching you guys. Uh, 
TikTok. First, I'm going to show you Canva, a little Canva, how I export my videos on Canva. I go into TikTok and I use the computer on TikTok and I, um, and I uh, upload onto TikTok. But what, what the TikTok on the computer has a very good feature. It's got scheduling where you can schedule your posts in advance. So instead of you waking up every single day and posting, it's got scheduling. So let's um, let me share my screen. In fact, let me first share my presentation. Let me mute you guys. I get some power. My 30 minutes of power. Fatima. Tell me, just give me a thumbs up if you can see my screen, right, uh, Fatima? Perfect. So guys, welcome to the social breakfast. Uh, we've done it for five years now and it grew substantially during COVID. Uh, COVID was actually uh, very good for us. So today, welcome. We're talking about, give you a small about us, who we are. Uh, I'm going to give you an introduction about the social breakfast. I'm going to give you some uh, social media stats. That right now, we're sitting on 8 billion people. There's over 8 billion people. And of that 8 billion people, uh, 5, 5 billion are on social media. That's over 60% of the population on social media. Today, the topic I'm talking about TikTok. Uh, we all love TikTok. TikTok is the most used platform right now. So that's why I'm giving so much of attention to TikTok because it's, a, it's an easy way to get a lot of eyeballs and traffic. And also the ads are quite cheap. So I spent, last week I spent about 90 Rand um, and I got about 5,000 views. So it's, it's quite affordable right now. And then you guys can network, use the platform to network and chat to each other. So a little bit about us. Uh, we started the social breakfast exactly five years ago in uh, March, 2019. And it's all about networking and um, and it's all about doing business. And listen, don't ever despise networking. Networking is important. You've got to, you never stop networking. Because I can tell you honestly, I, I connected with a lot of people just by networking. And most of them are still my friends right now. Like look at a, a good example is uh, Fatima. Fatima and I became best friends, BFS, and we met five years ago. Uh, so... You, you don't know who's going to connect you to your next, uh, you know, to your next um, uh, big, big client. So discover how to to profit massively from social media while everyone else is freaking out. So basically, my goal is to help you uh, monetize social media. I want you to get money out of social media, meaning that you uh, must get sales. It's not about all the vanity. It's all. Of, it's not about uh, just looking nice in the numbers. It's about sales, money in the bank. So a little bit about about, about me. 21 years in digital marketing, having worked both on agency side and client side. I've been trained locally and internationally. Uh, I've won a few awards, and I'm not to brag or to boast, uh, but to tell you that you're in good hands. Um, that's I'm sharing the stage there with all the big, all the big guns there. Those guys are uh, uh, that's uh, Malusi from ECR, and um, that's David Lope, I think his name is. He's an author of many books. So as you can see, I was like the least uh, qualified there, but I've been. I've been uh, speaking on stage as well. These are some of the clients that I've been privileged to work with. So we're, all of us, we want clients. And I'm sure all of us. And the best way to get clients is by marketing. Marketing right now is the best way to get clients. And we teach companies how to market. And these are some of the workshops we do uh, all over the world. We, I mean, all over the country, even all over the world we do. Because we've got people signing in from all over the world uh, on Zoom. So what's the most valuable currency? Uh, I'm just going to play two, uh, one minute of this clip because most of you guys on the call already watched this, this clip like 5,000 times. This is my favorite part. So I'm going to stop with them. So the most uh, the valuable, so attention is the most valuable currency. If you notice, all of them were stuck on their phones. We spend over six hours a day on our mobile phones. And I'm sure if you when, you, when your phone dies, 
you don't know what to do. You lost. You lost. You don't know what to do with your life because your your phone is dead. I'm going to skip all of that. Some um, stats, as I said to you briefly earlier, eight billion people in this earth, five of five billion of them on social media. So uh, the population grew by 0.9 percent. Social media grew by 5.6 percent. This is the growth of social. This is the time people spend on social media daily. Uh, the first one is Kenya. The second one is uh, South Africa. South Africa, South Africa spent South Africa. South Africans spend one two seconds less than Kenya online, and I believe that's because of load shedding. Uh, the top reasons why people use social media. Look at the number one reason: keeping in touch with friends and family. So what that means is that when we go to social media and we post our brands, we are disrupting. Uh, TikTok is the most used platform just to prove to you. That's why today I'm doing TikTok and YouTube is so right now we're in the video age. You got to you post a lot of videos. Uh, use the hashtag. These are the hashtags. Uh, the FYP hashtags are getting trillion. The T stands for trillion. That's a million million. So you got to FYP. Look at the engagement of these hashtags. So my advice to you is to use hashtags. And this is the type of content you need to be posting on social media. Films, funny videos, how to... Uh, repeats of shows, spot. That's a, that's a content themes. I'm not saying to you to post those those topics. Try and include, incorporate those themes into your content and your content will go viral. So today we've been talking about TikTok. I'm going to uh, switch over to my, uh, I'm going to switch over to my computer and I want to first show you. So basically to, advise, to tell you what's happening here, I am now in my in my Canva. So go to Canva. Canva is a is a tool that you can use to create a good, uh, beautiful graphics done for you. I'm using the free version. Uh, I've already got a I've already got a graphic created. Now Canva, this is the canvas of the stage. I just want to hide this. This is the stage. You can drag elements on them, uh, drag and move. You can add text. If you want to animate this thing, you just click on this element and you can click on uh, you can click on animate and it's going to animate it for you, right? And you can also add sound. There's sounds you can add. And I'm going to click on share on the top right. And I'm going to click download. I must download it as a as a um, I need to download it as a MP4, MP4 video. So now that I downloaded it, it's in my downloads folder. There's my downloads folder that's there. So now I want to go to, into, I want to upload this. So go to tiktok.com, go to tiktok.com and sign in. So I like to sign in with my phone number because they send me, I don't need to remember my password. They just send me a code and I sign in. So this is what TikTok on the computer looks like. Uh, this is my profile. And on the top right, there's a button called upload. Now, as you can see, I can see all my uh, videos that I posted. I'll see how many views I got. Uh, so the one I posted yesterday got 400 views. And the reason I got four, it's, the reason it got 400 views and the one previous one got 200 views and the one previous to that got 85 views. The reason why it's, um, it's, uh, it's, 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 it, it they, they differ is because of the hashtags. You've got to use the right hashtag. As I'm saying to you, you need to use the right hashtag. Now, this one has got 4,000. This one's got uh, 50,000. Uh, that's because of I boosted those things. I added my credit card in there and I boosted. Like just to give you an example, this Samsung one I boosted for ninety rand. This one that I've got fifty thousand followers, I mean views, I boosted that one for uh, two hundred rand. So you see the difference. It's actually quite affordable. So on the top right is a button called upload. You click on upload. It's a bit slow because I'm also using video. So it'll tell you select a video to upload. Uh, so click on select files. Now I'm going to go onto my desktop where I save my Canva video. Uh, this is my Canva video. I'm going to click on that and it will upload. So while it's uploading, it will tell you who can view the visibility. Everyone can, can view it. Uh, but for this lesson, I'm going to make it uh, friends. And then I'm gonna uh, I can choose schedule. Now can you see it says allow users to comment a duet stitch so people can use your video in their duets in their stitches. So 
as you can see, it's opened up on the right hand side and you can say schedule video. So I'm going to choose, I'm, I'm going to put this on schedule video. Click on schedule video and I want to, I want to schedule it uh, for tomorrow at 8, at 8 a.m. Right, just got to just got to play around it, and then you can. This is disclosure to say that it's your content, and all you just got to disclose that it's AI. If it's AI, uh, if you need to run a copyright check, and now uh, you can choose edit the cover. You can either upload a cover. You can either upload a cover from your computer, or you can um, use the cover that's in there. You can just select any part of your timeline and upload a cover. Just gonna put my clock on, and then you can click on. Uh, confirm and then before you click schedule you need to put a, a caption so the caption usually is two or three lines it's going to say um, check out pics from my Samsung event last week and then add a few hashtags add about four or five hashtags I'm going to use the hashtag FYP, I always use FYP, and then FYP will give you variations. And as you can see, it's got billions of posts. So you can start using those hashtags. I don't overuse them, but uh, while, while it's still hot, strike while it's still hot, um, I would say use it because another one I use is Sama, um, 28. Uh, you also get a lot of uh, engagement. And then I'm also, you also add a few hashtags, what the, what the post is about. So this post is about social media. Right. And then I come to the bottom and I just click schedule. And then my post is scheduled. Right. So that's one way to do it. Then um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to upload another video. I'm going to click upload a video. And so what I do as well is I post a lot of memes on my on my post. So I post a lot of I post a lot of uh, memes. So I, I go to uh, Instagram and I download it. I just use an app to download. So let's um, upload this file here. Let's see what it is. I downloaded a few videos yesterday and uh, I didn't upload it. Okay, this is a good one. This is what this one is like. Uh, this one it says uh, mm, Mario, Mario, Mario Bro Boss, right? And I'm gonna let it go through now and I'm gonna post. It's posted fully, and then um, I'm gonna go and view it. Now, if I go back to TikTok, and um, there's my two posts there. There's the post I posted there. You're not going to see the scheduled post because the scheduled post is scheduled. And if I click on this video, video right right so see, you see i showed you how to, i showed you how tiktok works i showed you how to post on tiktok i showed you how to schedule on tiktok and i also showed you how to get your video how to create a video using canva i'm not going to teach you canva because that's another lesson go back and watch the previous videos um yeah so that is canva that is um uh tiktok and let's continue with our slide you guys can just uh ask me questions just now in five minutes So I showed you that um, I showed you that uh, how easy it is to post on TikTok on using a uh, schedule on TikTok. Nobody died. So did you die? No, you didn't. It's easy. It's fun. So start posting every day. So I'm going to give you some content ideas. So it's April. What happens this month? Okay, I got the wrong slide there. It says February, but it's Valentine's month. So if you want ideas for your social media, there's a good site to go and get the teacherscorner.net. It gives you content for every single day. Now, obviously, you're going to go and use the latest month. So this is April. April, 
you can go and get, in fact, let's go to the teacher's corner. Let's go there. So I just search the teacher's corner.net. I go to April. So today is the 15th of April. Uh, today is the 15th. It we can tell us. So one thing that happens when you reach over 40 is your eyes go bad. So what I do is I zoom my screen and this is so. Yesterday was the website which they published. Yesterday was the Titanic stock. Uh, you can talk something about the Titanic. Uh, income tax day, it's boring. <laughs> uh, keep it positive, guys. Keep it positive. Don't ever talk about negative stuff because negative stuff is what's going to kill your social media. Uh, there's a lot of birthdays that's happening. Uh, pet owners day. Look at this on the 18th is pet owners day. You can maybe post a picture of your pet, or you can also influence your um, more, uh, encourage your, your your encourage your followers to um, share a picture of their post of of their pet. Uh, there's so much of content. Can you see? So te the teachers corner dot net. Uh, history.com is also a good place to get content this day in history keep it positive keep it uh, don't talk about negative stuff uh, you also wikipedia did you know and on this day so people are suckers for general knowledge like this is an example of did you know and general knowledge look at the amount of engagement you get so this is the types of posts you can post on a daily basis that's why it's called social media if you notice People, when you're on Facebook, people invite you to play games and stuff because that's what social media is. Social media is a playground. It's all about games. It's all about funny. It's all about laughing. It's about being entertained. Uh, if you want, if you're a lazy social media manager, go to brainyquote.com and share the post. Brainyquote.com. And Pinterest has got some good ideas. You can come to Pinterest, get the ideas, and recreate this using Canva, which I just showed you. Another good thing is called UGC. UGC stands for User Generated Content content where you ask your followers, fans, and your customers, clients to submit them using your your, your products or your or your services. It's even a testimonial is UGC. Uh, this is the Father's Day UGC. This is the Father's Day UGC. This is a Starbucks UGC uh, where, where the customer colored in his cup and sent it to you to Starbucks. This is a this is my own personal UGC where I visit the Lion Park and I sent it to the to the to, to the car manufacturer and they said let's use it. Uh, this is a Vans Techies UGC. Yeah, so that's uh, the end of my presentation. I'm going to stop the share. I'm going to open up and you guys can ask me any questions about social media. You guys can ask me. Just unmute and ask me any questions. Hi, it's me. <laughs> Hi, guys. Um, my name is Fatima, and I have been with Sunil for about five over five years now, doing his social media breakfast. And every day, every time I come on, I'm learning something new. So, um, and we're always wondering uh, with regards to asking questions. So I'm always asking a question. So I previously did ask Sunil this on a private uh, chat. So I'm going to put it out there as well for you guys to get an idea of what the question I asked. So Sunil, when it comes to followers and, and stuff, um, how do we generate followers? Like for instance, um, if somebody likes my post, um, do I and follow follow me or something? Do I go and check? Because you are able to see who likes and who commented. Do I go and follow them in order to so, get a follower? So yeah, but this is what I do. I go and check who they are. If they've got a good following, if they've got a good following, then I follow them back. Uh, uh, so the, the rule of thumb is on social media, when anybody goes and leaves your comment, don't just like the comment, reply to every single comment. It's like being in like a real life situation. Imagine you are having a coffee with somebody, your friend, and she talks to you and uh, uh, she tells you, oh, I like that brooch of yours. And you just brush it off. You ignore her and you, uh, you uh, have a sip of your coffee. 
So you've got to bring the real life, um, how you engage in real life with people into social media. So every time, every time somebody comes and leaves you a comment, every comment must be answered. So you got to, you like the comment and you come and you reply on the comment. Okay. Now, don't fo just follow everybody. They must be, go and see, if this guy is sitting in, in Thailand, it could be a scammer, you understand, or a binary trader. Don't follow him. So I set my settings on TikTok that, I, that only people who I follow can, can comment on my posts. So that way, I have never got a message on, on TikTok. For the past two years, I haven't Me got too. a message on, on TikTok. Mm, right. So only people yeah. who, can, who I follow can send me a message or can comment on my post. Nobody can comment on my post. Remember, my, 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 my social media is only for branding. So if you want to contact me, send me a WhatsApp or phone me or email me, you understand? So uh, I don't do business with the DMs and, and all that because I get so much of spam, so much of spam accounts. Okay, okay. Yeah, no, because I also don't get comments, but I do get likes. So I think I have more likes than, more, uh, than followers. <laughs> yes, because it's oh, easier to like. But my advice, yeah. you, my advice to you, all of you who are on the call, Start today and be a good social media player. Don't just like posts. Go and comment and leave a review and share your posts. Be a good uh, sport. Be a good, uh, um, you know, um, a good. Be a good um, friend or a colleague. So don't just like. Don't because the like carries no nothing. The like when you like the post, it it doesn't carry any weight. So like the post, leave them a comment and share the post. What you're doing then is you're helping them grow. Whoever's page it is. And do that for all your friends. There's, there's 11 of us here now. Put your social media handles on there and go and like, follow, and comment on everybody's posts. You'll see how your, your, po your pages will start to grow. Because social media is reciprocal, meaning that when you you got to give first to receive. So if you're wondering why you're stuck on social media, it's because you post and ghost. You go in, you post, and you leave. So the, the trick is you got to go and engage Spend about half an hour engaging with other people's posts. And remember what I'm saying to you. The most important thing today, what I'm saying to you, don't just like a post. Go and comment and share the post. You're going to help them so much. It's also going to help you because it's reciprocal. So, Fatima, five gold stars for you. I'm going to send you five virtual gold stars for asking that question. Any more questions, okay. guys? Any more questions? Um, okay. Uh, okay yes now with me when it comes to posting stuff um like um is like i have been doing voiceovers so i'll pick like a, a certain um image and i'll do a voiceover my own recording voice on it and then i will post it uh i'll create a video out of it and then i'll post it on tiktok is that is that okay yeah that's fine that's fine but that's remember fine. those platforms um uh, don't just sell on those platforms um no no no, show, no. it's, show it's who you just are. like a it's a it's a motivational uh, kind of yeah so uh, so have a mix of content have a mix of content have a mix of content what you uh, uh don't only sell don't only push product don't only uh you know also talk about be, be be a bit vulnerable as well tell them who you are tell them hey uh, i started from scratch uh, i started from uh, i started my social media from zero and i'm growing it daily you know you got to be show people that you're human yeah, because social media works yeah. with emotions. It's emotional. Uh, it, it tugs your emotional strain. So so show them that you are human. Do you know what I'm saying to you? Because people buy from people and uh, it's all about relationship building. Yeah. I like that uh, That what you just, that content you just said now with regards to, you know, show them that you're human. Um, you know, last week, Monday was a surprise to me because I ended up being on Lotus FM showcasing my business. And, um, you know, uh, one of the questions that was then like, you know, what inspired you to start your business? And I said, you know what, um, I went into a little bit of in-depth, but I didn't give them the, you know, the crux of it. And I was actually asked the question and um, I said to them, you know, I developed an autoimmune illness and I didn't want to say what illness it was until the question was, what was it? And I was like, yeah, list on radio sharing my my illness with them and i got a lot of response with regards to it where it gives people an you know an idea of who you are and how you can become vulnerable and how people can stigmatize it yeah yeah so listen you gotta use those cool. platforms thank you thank you gotta you gotta you gotta use those platforms to build a following you understand and there's a lot of people who are stuck in their lives like you shared something with people and you, you show to people that you're an overcomer number one 
And people love those success stories where even though you got an illness, it doesn't stop you from uh, living your life. You understand? Mm. So mm. just mm. Con- so continue, so continue, so continue doing that. that. That should have been proof to you why you should be posting. And thank you for sharing that, that, that with us because we all have a story to share. All of us have a story to share and all of us have followers. Like the followers, the people who follow me, uh, you will not uh, follow me. They, they won't like me. They might say, hey, this guy, uh, I don't like his style. Maybe he's too abrupt. Maybe he's, he's, his voice is too loud. Do you know what I'm saying to you? you? Everybody has a following. But if you don't start you're doing it, you're going to miss that opportunity of building a following. Okay. Thank you, guys. I'm going to go. Uh, I'm going to put this uh, on the social media. I'm going to record um, it. Who, anybody wants to ask any questions? Clara, did you want to ask questions? Yeah. Yeah, I want to do a podcast. Well, I just wanted to say to Fatima, uh, you are very brave and uh, how wonderful for you to share all that. Um, it's very encouraging. But um, what I wanted to say is I want to do a podcast. How do I go about it? Are you going to do a lesson on podcast? Yeah, maybe next week I'll do a question on podcast. Just drop it on the group and I'll do a, a lesson on podcast. Okay, thanks. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. And uh, well, I see Mala's on. Mala broke the law. Mala broke the law. She air fried a samosa. Mala bro- air fried a samosa. Mala, you there? No, I think she's muted. Guys, I'll see you guys. I'll chat to you later after the call. But um, you guys are um, uh, you guys are welcome to attend uh, uh, next week as well. So I'll send you guys the podcast lesson. Listen, pod- podcasts are used. But in fact, in SA, we're doing podcast, VOD, video podcast. Sorry, Sunil, I couldn't. Yeah. I couldn't unmute myself. It's okay, it's okay. But uh, yes, it was uh, Pata. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna invite you guys soon. You all are welcome. Listen, you're gonna you're gonna invite all of us, especially me. You don't know, don't worry about others, but invite me. I would love to have all of you <laughs> here to try all my different <laughs> eats. I <laughs> promise you, it you're gonna enjoy it. <laughs> cool, man. Cool. Thanks, Mala. Thanks for tuning. Hope you guys learned something. Thank you so much. Learning lots. Bye, guys. Have a good one. Happy Monday.